Hello. How's everyone? It's Cynthia. I'm testing my new iPhone, which I just received a few days ago. And I am trying to figure out the different perspectives and how it records color and what the image looks like. Anyway, so I'm going to do a tour of my art collection for my first video because I'm not ready yet. And then later today, after I get my hair and makeup done, I'll come back on and talk about current events and what's going on in this crazy world of ours. So this is my, one of my favorite pieces. This is an original artwork. This is an oil painting on cloth canvas. And as you can see, it's really beautiful. And I really like this piece. Let me give you a perspective on the size of it. Yeah, I think it's really pretty. I, I, this is really my favorite. Right? Okay. This is my Renoir. Yeah, this is, you know, this is my most pe most serious piece of art. This is my Renoir. And uh, actually my former husband gave this to me because I think it symbolized, it symbolizes the relationship we were meant to have but never really had because we both loved Europe. And like I've been to Paris and I even worked for a French cosmetics company a few times in my career. So I really think that's what this piece is about. But this is a, this is a Renoir. This is from uh, 1910, I think. Anyway, it's real. It's a, it's a real uh, heliograve, I think they're called. And uh, I have the papers and everything on it. So that's what the, this is a bona fide Renoir. There, signed. So anyway, that's that That's that one. I really love that too, as you can imagine. That's my outside. Isn't it awesome? Yeah. This is, a, this is just a Salvador Dali lithograph. It's part of the collection known as the Divine Comedy. It's signed and numbered. It's real too. This is me when I was young during my career. Yeah, I know. I know. I try not to think about it too much. Anyway, this was me during my career, probably in the early 1980s. But yeah, that was me. Wow. Okay. Uh, this is my command center here. Look at this. So all the stuff that I have to use so I look like a human being when I make one of these videos. Right? Pretty wild. And uh, anyway, I'm into the Estee Lauder recently, but I use L'Oreal too. I use a lot of stuff from Target, to be honest with you. I use CeraVe. Uh, I use uh, Cetaphil, but CeraVe is really good. It's good stuff. Um, I haven't gotten into all the peels and all that stuff, but I may do that at some point. But anyway, this is... Yeah, this stuff is good. Resilience, multi-effect, tripeptide. That stuff's good. These are all my gift bags. Anyway, Estee Lauder, try it. If you can afford it, try it. It's worth it. It's worth every penny. This is a... Well, I see the re a reflection is hitting this one. This is a really nice watercolor. You can see the window in, in the background. Let me see if I can close the shade. Hold on. Those are my feet. Those are my cheeks. These are my awesome chairs. We had an estate sale when my former husband died and I literally had to wrestle my own chairs out of the hand of a greedy estate sale attendee. And I told her, I said, you know, these look really good from the ground, from the floor. Would you like to see them from the floor? Anyway, that's how I got my chairs. This is my workstation, my crowded workstation. That's my sculpture, a sculpture I have. Isn't that pretty? Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, I'm so lucky. 
so freaking lucky. Anyway, here's my, here's the watercolor. This is a big piece. Again, this is a signed original piece, but I think this one is, yeah, this is numbered, but it's out of 500. There, were fi there are 500 of these. There's only one of these. <clears throat> so don't try anything. I know they can 3D print anything now, but if I see this anywhere else, I'm coming for you. So don't try it, all right? This is an original painting. Ugh. This too, don't even think about it. These are all numbered with papers, you know, like serial numbers. Okay, I'm almost done here. Let's see. That's my antique oak. I think that's oak and walnut, but it's a really nice, like mirror piece. This is my closet full of all my treasures. There's no light in there, so you can't really see how fabulous some of these things are. Okay. This is my bright bathroom. I redid it in a pretty coral. I really love it. It makes me happy. Oh, yeah. This is just a regular painting. This is number three out of a hundred. But it always reminded me of like the Greek islands with the bleached white buildings and the pretty. I really just hung it in here because these flowers match my shower curtain. See that? Life is about the details. And I also love the blue of the sky. Anyway, if I can, in a few more hours, I'll be back on here in my uh, full, uh, whatever, grooming. You know, it takes a while. I really did this to get a sense of the color and how this picks up image and color and scale. So I'll see everyone in a few hours. It's Cynthia. Bye. Thanks for watching.